Good morning, good morning, good morning. Today's scripture reading is coming from the fifth chapter of the book of Amos. And I'll be reading from uh, uh, verse 21 through 24, no, 25. And it reads as follows. I hate, I despise your feast days and will not smell in your solemn assemblies. Though you offer me burnt offerings and your meat offerings, I will not accept them. Neither will I regard the peace offering of your fat beast. Take thou away from me the noise of thy song, for I will not hear the melodies of the Lord. But let judgment run down as waters, and righteousness as a mighty stream. The word of God for the people of God. In this setting, we see here how the prophet Amos was talking to the nation of Israel, speaking to them what does say the Lord about their false worship and uh, religious hypocrisy. And we see a lot of that. And he was telling them, said, even though I, I'm just, I just despise your peace offering and your feast days, and I will not accept what you offer me because it's only out of a ritual that you're doing this. But where is your heart? And let me say to all of us today, you are believing in professing Christ. Whatever we do for Christ, let our heart be at the center and the motivating factor of pleasing God because we are to worship him in spirit and in truth. Our half-hearted worship will not get us anything but a rejection from the almighty God. And we do not want to be rejected by God. We want to be praised and we want him to accept our offering. So let us get our hearts right and worship him. Because he tells us in verse 24, judgment is going to rain down like water, but righteousness as a mighty stream. And we know there's only one true righteousness, and that is the righteousness of Christ. And when we go against the will of God, we are going to face his wrath. And his judgment can be very fierce. And we've studied the book of um, well, not the entire Bible, especially the Old Testament, when Israel was punished for doing that for long, long doings, and they were rewarded and blessed for their righteousness. So I declare, or I say, or I plead with all of us today, get right with God. And if you are already right with him, stay right. Live Manifest his righteousness through our daily life. And by all means, give him a heartfelt praise and worship. God loves you. So do I. Have a blessed day. Like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. And help us get to 4,000, at least 4,000 subscribers and followers by the end of this year. That may not seem like much, but I used to. Our subscriber list is, list is constantly growing. And then go to our website, theshepherdministry.org, and become uh, join our mail, email list to get regular posts and direct in your email inbox. Or just go to our Facebook page and become a follower of the Shepherd Ministry, the church. Have a blessed day.